Hey guys, Mike O'Brien, Mondays with Mike. So if you're not going to Kensington Valley CrossFit, you may or may not have seen some of these food posts we're doing. And our hope is to hopefully maybe share some secrets on what is healthy, what's in our ingredients, and maybe to take a look at you know, what we're eating. One of the challenges we're gonna do this week is you gotta show a picture of what was in your carts. I just did the crazy trip to Costco on a Sunday. It's me all my stuff that I need for the week. So let's unbox this. All right, so let's take a look here. Uh, we got a little bit of everything. We got our protein, our veggies. Now, just so you guys know where I'm at, I am trying to get as much sugar out of my diet, processed foods out as possible right now, just to see how my body responds, how I feel, what's going well, what's not going well. So you're gonna see that I've got a lot of veggies here. And one of the things I've been struggling with is just to get a high uh, number or to get enough carbs in my system that aren't coming from potatoes or some processed food. Trying to find some things like Brussels sprouts here. Brussels sprouts are pretty high uh, in carbohydrates. And so compared to asparagus, um, not so high in carbohydrates. So when we're trying to make sure we still meet our goals, um, we've got to make sure we've got the right stuff. So let me tell you what I have. So I like the five pack of lettuce, romaine. Um, one of those usually goes in my salad uh, with, uh, I, lately I've been eating a whole cucumber, uh, tomatoes, that's for my lunch. In here I've got salmon, lean steak, that, that'll serve for a couple dinners, and a chicken. Now this pack of chicken, this is probably like two weeks of chicken. So I will cook two or three packages. I put them in a big container and then, you know, depending on what I feel like for the day, I prep it. So at least every time in my fridge, if you go in there, there's some kind of protein that I can easily add to a salad. Lately in the morning, I've been doing spinach. So I've got this organic spinach and three whole eggs, two egg whites, and then a whole avocado. So I've got the Costco avocados. Now the trick with the Costco avocados, they're not ripe for tonight. They are like, they're, they're a couple days out. So you've always, if you're buying them from Costco, you gotta make sure you've got some. Now, one of the things I don't have, but if you look at this avocado, this, when it's uh, out and on my plate, it's probably gonna be about four ounces uh, of avocado. When you go to Meijer, their avocados are about six. So weighing and measuring your food, right? This is what I use. We've talked about uh, the scale before. So I weigh and measure everything. But really, I think the goal is to be successful in any bit of your food journey. You've got to do a couple things. Number one, you've got to have the food. You've got to have it at your house. Number two, everybody says they struggle with lunch. And so if you're busy, uh, I think I qualify as a busy human being sometimes. You've got to have stuff prepped. Sundays is a great day to do it. So don't be afraid. Maybe I, uh, with the Brussels sprouts, I throw them in a saute pan. I cut them up, quarter them, some garlic, some salt and pepper. And then I'll take, you know, four or five ounces, maybe six ounces, depending on what I'm eating that day. And I put my six or seven ounces of chicken in there. That's my lunch. It's packaged. It's easy to do. It's in the fridge, ready to go. So don't be afraid. You got to get creative. You got to change it up a little bit or you're going to get bored. Uh, likewise. So I love some peanut butter. I hate I hate natural peanut butter, uh, but I'm just trying to make sure I get the right balance. And uh, so I do use a little peanut butter in my food. So uh, I did buy the organic A because it has no sugar in it. So this is my shopping cart for the week. Let's see your pictures. Hopefully you can share some stuff with us. Hopefully you can share some tips. Uh, more to come. I hope everybody has a great week. Try to stay on track uh, with our balanced meals. And let's see those pictures of your shopping carts. Have a great day, everybody.